Pam param pam, pam param pam pam. <laughs> Loves it. Yo guys, boys and girls, it is Kiralis. And welcome to Hermicraft. I gotta say, spam I'm a spam wax base, right? What is you? Spam's magic water block. Do not disturb. <laughs> no, no, I can't. I can't do any block updates. That's bad, that's cruel. Let it water be. It kinda looks funky though, you know what? I love it. You can just, you know, a foot bath. I gotta say, Spamwag, he chose his location wisely for the Hermitcraft town. Or Hermitown. Look at that. Hermiton. I mean, how amazing. Look, he's got a view of everything. He can see, like, I'm gonna see what's going on here today. What's going on in the shopping district, kinda. What's Keralis doing with his beacons? I don't know. But that's pretty amazing. So, welcome back to Hermitcraft. Before we do anything in this episode, though, I just want to check out the new commercial district area, you know? It's not new, but there's stuff been added. I've been seeing videos of stuffs. So let's do check it out and see what's going on. By the way, Unhost is building. You know what? Let's check out Unhost first. Unhost's crib. Hello? Oh yeah, it's no pressure plate. All right. <laughs> the special plate's here. All right. What is this? Is this, kind of, is this a carpet or is this like the Jamaica flag? A Jamaica man? I don't know. <laughs> Don't get me oh, whoa 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 what has happened? Is this a sneaky entrance back to the to the to the shopping district or is this like a, <laughs> a creeper is bl blowing up stuff? I don't know. I don't know. But one thing which I know one has been working on is this, which I gotta say, I need to get one of those. It's the cheaty fishing hole. I mean you can just stand about here and get all the fish and loot you want. Fishing roads only. You know what? I need to check this out. I need, I need to I need to get one of those in the future guys in the future I can just imagine That would be amazing having that like a back at base at the booby mountain or something. I don't know Nice work nice work and host hike to the sign perfect and let's see here So by the way, I've been thinking I've been thinking guys In the previous episode. I told you that we're gonna build this pool or we're gonna start a pool or something I don't think I'm gonna do a pool. I don't know Free samples just press the button it's not like you eat the pack dice now, do you? You just place it. Oh, that's not nice. That's that's nice. Thank you. The fresh the fresh sample thingy. How do where is the Oh I see. Can this shoot through blocks? I didn't know that it was possible. Let's put it back in. <laughs> I don't wanna you know. <laughs> thank thank you, Sleepy Gator. Thank you for the free sample. I get to design. I don't want one of those, you know. It's packed ice. It's can it can't it, no no. It is not like whoa. Oh my god, chunks reload now. There we go. The muse meets has been like you know, it has been cleared out as you can see. You can actually see in here. Question is like muse muse meats, muse meats, prices. I know it's a meat shop, right? But He's got a couch and TV and everything. Look at this guy. He's, you know? But then again, he's building this, which I have absolutely no idea what it's gonna be, but it is absolutely humongous. Is this the meat factory thingy? <laughs> Hello, piggies. What you doing up here? I have no idea what this is gonna be. But it is huge, that's for sure. Look at this. Ba bam! <laughs> Magnificent. Holy moly! What the hell? Mix and match any combination. No way! Someone, somebody beat it to me. Like you know, beat me to it. <laughs> beat it to me. You <laughs> love it. Beat me to it. They build a blue shop and my favorite flower of them all, the blue orchid. I love those blue orchids. I'm gonna buy some. How much is this? Payment: one gold bar equals ten. One diamond equals one hundred. I got diamonds. I'm gonna buy. Not all of them, but a lot of them. But then, whoever built this, hack to the sign because that was nice. That was nice. Hack to the pole. But then again, we got this, which is going to be the court building, which Ashwani is working on. So that's going to be kind of cool. Whoa! It is not much of flooring in here, but it's going to be. So you know what? I think we need to find the thief, the thief who stole name tag and put the person. In charge of their actions. <laughs> Zombie Cleo. I'm not saying any names. Zombie Cleo. Who? Who somebody, did somebody just mention Zombie Cleo? I don't know. Did somebody say Zombie Cleo? Did I say Zombie Cleo? Maybe Zombie Cleo. I don't know. That Cleo Zombie. Maybe Zombie Cleo. Who's this? No, that is not Zombie Cleo. That's Beefus Bakery. Hmm. And this is new. 
Hypno's random item shop. I haven't been I haven't been here in ages. I mean, it kind of feels like I've been here gone like forever. You choose. Oh, so I choose two diamonds each. Okay, so we got the slime balls. Free gold per stack. I, I, you know, I love this. One thing which I wish they build was a quartz shop. I would buy all the quartz in the world. And host unnamed fishing emporium. That is new as well. Or is it? I don't know. I love it. So much stuff. This excitement. Can you hear my voice? It's pretty frank delicious. And then we got this, which is Bambo's thingy. The Redstone Consultancy. I don't know. This is why I love Hermitcraft, you know? There's like this stuff popping up all the time. And just people just being nice. But what I thought I'm going to do today, instead of the pool. I know some people are screaming like, Keralis, for God's sake, build a pool. You're going to need to have a pool. Let me see. Is there a second edition out? Second editions of the Hermiton Herald. Subscription. Info. Oh. Yep, we're gonna end the episode on reading the news, guys. Just brace yourself. But I'm, I was thinking, okay, pool. Do I really need a pool? Like, will I really use my pool? When I get, like, my neighbors or my neighbor. Pungeons, AK Stinky Balls, like, he's got a jacuzzi and pool and everything. I mean, I live, I can just end a pool from my to, to this place and maybe use his pool or whatnot. I don't know. But I was thinking, let's do a gazebo. But first of all, I need to go, ooh, Spidey. I need to go to the nether nether and get some quartzy blocks because I'm, I'm lacking those. Because we're going to build a gazebo. Gazebo out of quartzy. Dude, dude, please. I hate those guys. They're destroying my bushes. I need to light this area up, I guess, better. Thanks so much for helping with Bush's Gardens slip. No way! Are you for real? Zombies. Zombies. <laughs> They're just... Look at this. Look at, look, at, look at below my house, by the way. Look at below my house. It is, this is like a madness underneath here. I need to fix this. <laughs> it looks so crap. I know. But don't worry, I'm going to fix that. But no way, Jose! No! Look at this little sneaky ninja zombie. Nobody can see. No, wait, yep, 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 yep. Look at this! He was trying to ambush me, that the guy. He was just hiding in the bushes. But this is so awesome! I mean, I don't need to go to the nether nether. I hate that place. And we got some glowstone. Holy snap, Slip! That is so awesome. I'm gonna hug. <laughs> I'm hugging everything today for some reason. But guys, you know what? Let me just clear out some land in the back of the house. And then we're gonna start a gazebo project. Because I was thinking. Okay, I was thinking. I told you guys. Please. Yes, perfect. I told you guys that we're gonna build a pool in this area, right? But then I thought to myself. No. Maybe we can have the pool or some, you know, some other place. Some about. But here, I was thinking like, let's make a gazebo gazebo and then we can like have like trees on the like sides here everywhere and bushes and just gonna be looking fantastic so let me just clear out some land get some tools and some materials and figure out where we're gonna have it exactly and then i'm gonna resume i love my house and i love sleep gator <laughs> to take sleep i don't have to go to the internet nether. that saves me like at least two hours because <laughs> i hate that place i die there all the time dude where did you get that bush from No, <laughs> this is so mad down there. They're just coming. I need to, I need to, you know, I need to prepare myself. I need to build traps or something. Guys, yes, 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 yes. See you in a bit. By the way, do I get the fart bubbles on? Oh my god, the fart bubbles. You know, I was, I was getting some sand, right? For, for some glass and stuff. <gasps> no! Phew. That scared the shit out of me. I was like, oh my god, <laughs> my house is burned down or something has happened. <gasps> I was I, yo, I was getting some sand, right? Oh no. That was bad. And I came here and I was like, hello chest. Open up the chest and bam! Full diamond armor. But no sign. Can this be Shashwam, you guys think? I don't know. Somebody did that pretty nice of them like if you guys know who this was please let me know in the comment section below the video 
Hello, my name is Keralis, and today we're gonna build the gazebo here. <laughs> I know, some of you, look at this, I've been professional, you know, I'm gonna a crafting bench, you know, a chest with stuff, so, you know, just, just like a professional builder. So I thought to myself, I've been, I've been building many pools in my life, but I've never done a gazebo, so why not just build a gazebo? And as thinking, pillow quartz blocks, I mean, that's gotta be something, right? So what if we just lay out uh, some foundation and then we get groovy? I don't know about this. How is this space? <laughs> I ain't building Stonehenge, that's for sure, but you know what? Question is, gazebos. I've seen some gazebos in my life. I've never owned one myself. Why are, what, are, what is a gazebo? To be precise, is there like a just a seating area, maybe chillax area? <laughs> Look at this! <laughs> we can make sacrifices to the bush gods, I don't know. It's gotta be some type of chill out area, right? Something to do with chill out and relax. And then dark oak wood planks, because that's just a, such amazing material. So this is gonna be our entrance. Question is, do we want more entrances than this entrance? Or is we fine with one entrance? I don't know, let's just go with this. And for now, maybe we can use some upstairs downstairs. Here in the corners, is that possible? How do we connect you? You connect like that, right? Perfect. <laughs> I've never played Minecraft, this is my first time. But, yeah guys, yet again, thank you very much for this amazing support of the Sermicraft series. I am blown away. You seem to be rocking every episode. And I'm enjoying recording this, but you know, as I said, it's gonna be like one to two episodes per week of Hermitcraft. Just because, you know, resource gathering and stuff like that it takes time for me. In this episode, I was pretty lucky because of some amazing guy called Sleepy Gator. Question is, as thinking. So, so if you don't like, you know, like, where is Hermitcraft? Where is Hermitcraft? Don't worry, it's gonna, it's gonna be up, guys. When I quit Hermitcraft, I'm gonna let you know, alright? But maybe we can put some glows underneath here. Don't worry, we're gonna, we're gonna push it out and make it really pretty later on. But for now, this is something we, we got rocking here. We got rocking this. And the funny thing is, you know, I started the Attack of the B Team modded Minecraft series, which is so much fun. I, I'm really enjoying myself. Uh, it's, I don't know, it's so many cool mods. <laughs> A little barrier or some, of some type. Or maybe, yeah, you know what? Let's keep that. Maybe like that, all the way around. What you guys, um, can I jump up on you? No, I can't, you know what? Let's let's build something, because I need a lookout point, right? Because I, I, I like to look on stuff from above for some reason. That is all right. Um, I'm having so much so much fun in, in that series. So, like, I don't know, by the way, if that glowstone here would emit any light. But you know what? I don't care at this point. Let's just make it pretty like that. But I've been noticing, like, the first episode, or maybe the second episode, which was released, a lot of people are like, have you stopped Hermit Craft? And I'm like, no, like, it's a total different series, guys. That's a modest series, this is a vanilla series. With me, Kiralis. Because for some reason, I've got into this vanilla thing again. <laughs> gazebo, <laughs> hello, Gazebo. <laughs> what you doing, Gazebo? Uh, barrier should be here. Like that. Perfecto mundo. Then we can do this here, right? Like a little railing. Or something. But I was also thinking glass. Should we like put glass in this gazebo? That kind of looks kind of kind of strange. The sacrifice to the bushes. Although in mid floor here, that's going to be two by two. Like that. I'm sorry, by the way. Awkward commentary for the win with Keralis. That that is usually how we roll. But what is new in my life? Not much. Not much. You know, just chilling, relaxing, as as always. You know, I'm I'm a pretty chilled person. If you haven't noticed by now. Benches maybe, and we can have a table here in the middle. We have a glass table maybe. As thinking, God damn it, those fart bubbles. I can't do anything about them. You know, I can't turn it off. But, but for some reason, I like the torches. I like the animation from the torches. It makes me very happy. So that's gonna be like benches or sitting area. 
uh, not not much you know we went today to well actually you're going to be watching this tomorrow for me so so yeah yesterday <laughs> we went to to this little photoshop thingy um like a professional photographer and we booked a time for damien's like you know they're gonna take some cool baby pictures of damien and as well we took some pictures for his passport his swedish passport because at this point he's a british citizen he's living in sweden because his wife is british right so he's, she's got a british passport and for some law here in sweden like maybe it's just in the world the the baby which is born by by a mom <laughs> a female right <laughs> i love myself he takes like the nationality of of the of mom of the mom right and since wife is british he became british <laughs> i don't know what i like that about that you know no i love it but but he's gonna have a swedish as well because you know we'll live here why not have like double citizenships and this will be going like this yes that is so perfect Keralis. <laughs> no can I do this, by the way? Yes. So, but but that's not what I'm excited about. Although the pictures, like his passport photos were just amazing. I'm going to try to take a picture, guys, uh, of it, like with my phone or something. And I'm going to put it up on, on my Twitter or something. Because damn, he's, he's grown up. It's like, when you see him every day, like, you don't really like, you know, take any notice. Like, yeah, he's growing, he's growing, he's growing. But you don't really like, I don't know, you don't really see that that much people tell oh he's, he's grown i'm like oh, yeah he's grown but i see him every day so so that's a bit different i like this i like this you know what let's go sleepy sleep it's a new day it's a new day in hermitan and at keralis's house ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba -ba. so thinking here maybe we should do one block out I don't know how is that looking it's looking crap but yeah so when you see this bible every day you know you don't think about that so it's gonna be cool having like you know those little photos because he's growing up and it's going pretty fast now you know he's gonna be like he's 80 months old now you know and as soon as you're like one year and bam bada beam 18 moving out or like oh no where did the time go so i'm gonna have it like that i guess yeah let's keep it and in between those maybe we should spruce avuda or maybe dark old wood you know what let's try spruce avuda so it's gonna be cool having like those really professional photo photos of him like you know in derpy positions and stuff you know how you know how they make those baby photos they take like you know those animal pelts like a white pelt put them out and be like he 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 are perfect all nice and happy so it's gonna be amazing having them so we don't forget baby K, how he was when he was a baby. Oh god, I want to forget about those diapers, you know. Those diapers. Kids, don't get babies! <laughs> I tell ya, don't get those babies too early. <laughs> because those diaping changes, oh, they drive you nuts. Mm -hmm. ah, denied. Alright, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. Maybe from here. Ooh, there we go. Perfect. Bam. Like a boss, those beacons, they do so much something like this maybe and now we're thinking as thinking because this is going to be the entrance right so if we put i don't know it looks so strange and derp maybe if we put those chiseled ones how is this look gonna look <laughs> it's gonna look horrible i guess i don't know Let's let's keep him, alright? Let's keep him and see how this it turns out. But but yeah, so nothing has happened in my life. My life is pretty like, you know. It's kinda cool and chilled and relaxed. Yeah, I don't know. I like my life. I don't I'm not a stressy person, so I like, you know. I live in a good life, you know. I need I don't need to stress to go up to work in the mornings at this point, you know. Well I I have to, but since I work nights, I don't have to stress about the mornings. Are you kidding me? You know what? Let's let's pile up a little climb up here. Let's pillar up. <laughs> pile up. <laughs> what is that about? Maybe if we do this above all those. Is this looking like a gazebo? Yes, it's gonna be looking like a gazebo. Then in the middle, I thought we could add some some type of glass here, for example. 
Don't don't you dare judging this yet, all right? It's not done. When it's done, it's gonna be done done. But at this point, it's not done. Let me see, where's the full block coming? Oh, that's gonna look crap with the window, I guess. You know what? Let's try it out and see how that looks. So yeah, so I since I work nights, nice, I don't have to like I'm not really stressed out as I was before when I had an office job. That sucked. That sucked, you know. Getting up in those mornings, you know, winter, horrible, snow, taking forever to get to work. Just sucks. By the way, do I get some I was thinking gazebo. You know what? Green. Let me get out here and try this out, right? So if we put white here and glass around it, that becomes white stained clay. But if we exchange it to cactus green, is it gonna be green? You know what? Let's do it. Let's ha let's have <laughs> let's have a oh, let's have a, a green interior just because we can, all right? Don't worry about it. It's gonna be fine. But yeah, it's 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 awesome. Like having this opportunity. No idea how it's gonna be, no long it's gonna last, you know. I always get these questions all over the place, like, Kirazo, what, what would you, what will you do after YouTube? And it's it's so hard to answer, you know, because this might end tomorrow. This might end in like two years time. This might end in ten years time. Nobody knows. Table, <laughs> perfect. And up here, I was thinking, let's try those white ones. Ew. You know what? I'm not worried about that, because this is a gazebo. It can look whatever it, it can be, whatever we want it to be, right? There's no right and wrong in gazebos. It's just uh, like a do-it-yourself project at home. <laughs> but that kind of looks right. Don't 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 you dare judging it yet. So no, I have absolutely no idea what I will, will be doing after after YouTube. Like no idea, you know. I want. I don't. I don't want to think about that because that's kind of depressing, I guess. But, but you know, gonna do what we're gonna do. Nobody knows. And then we can maybe use. Let me see here. How would this look? If we, if I make this border here, right? Like that, all the way around. And we could have it open. But what if we close it down? As I thought from the beginning, like having those windows all over the place. It's still gonna be a bit windy because you know there's gonna be a draft, but I don't know, I like this. <laughs> it kinda looks messed up on the inside, I guess. But you know what? Don't worry about this now. Don't, don't worry about this. We can put this here to hide away the draft here, maybe. Like that. And that kind of hides the way some of the ugliness. You know what? Let me get more of those. So no, I don't know. You know, it's hard to say. I would work. I would love to work in, like in the gaming industry, but I have no, I have no like experience from it. So I don't know. We're gonna see when this ends, right? It's not. A, it's not that I'm thinking about it every day. Like what? Oh my God! I need to have a plan. I need to have a life plan. Maybe this. All right? Gazebo. <laughs> the derpiest looking gazebo in the world. <laughs> no, you know what? Don't judge it this. Don't judge it this. When we push this up and make this area pretty, this is gonna rock our boats. Trust me. Like that. Alright, I got this. What if we spice it up? Do I got fences? Yes, I got fences. Damn, I am so prepared. That is just crazy. Like that that and then have a little roof maybe one more and you might be thinking one more roof Kerales are you mad bro and I'm like oh, hell yeah maybe going up here let me see can I just squeeze in here and put it no it's gonna be an upside down no and by the way I'm actually gonna meet up with Doc M next week mm -hmm. we're going to Paris me and Doc on a little event thingy so that's gonna be pretty cool. I haven't met Doc before. You know, I've, I've spoken to him a bunch on Skype and stuff, but you know, it's kind of kind of different when you meet somebody, I guess. So that's gonna be pretty, pretty, pretty cool. Like that. Yes, yes, yes. And then we can delete this, put those here, and be really happy about it. So now we can go in here, sit down, 
just chill, relax. We could put some carpet on this as well, just to make it like look nicer, I guess. Or even though we could put glowstone underneath, or we could just put like torches about here, about <laughs> here, about seen about. That looks so crap, to be honest. You know what? We need to exchange those. It doesn't look nice. If we do this all the way, maybe. <laughs> Perfect. I like this little roof. Let's climb up and see and check it out. Bam. What if we make something derpy like I did in the beginning, like this? Because I was I was thinking about placing torches up here, but what if I just place them like that? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know. It's a it's a gazebo, you know. It doesn't have to be any special. I kind of don't like the draft here, but I would hate to have to have a full block. Let me see how the full block looks. I don't know. I kind of like that so much better for some reason. But yeah, I I know I get your point, guys. I know you're screaming like, yeah, but it's going to be very drafty and cold inside. And I'm like, yeah, I get your point. Because here, the benches are blocking it off, right? So that is no biggie. Still kind of looks all right, I guess. But here it looks blah, 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 blah. Crap. You know what I wish we could do in Minecraft, all right? Is to mix up the slabs, right? So for example, I could take... Like the spruce I would have slab and just place it on top here and be all happy about it, full block. But it's not possible. And that kind of sucks. Hmm. Maybe we should have... Let me see, if we have the stairs here instead. How is that gap looking now? Oh yeah, baby. Then we could have... No, no more stairs. That's fine. I guess. Let me know what you think, guys. If you, oh, by the way, if you have made a gazebos in Minecraft, please do tweet them. Maybe we can, like, transform this to a pretty place in the future. So I can get some ideas and inspiration. You know what? That, that looks alright. I like that, for some reason. This can go. And what I'm gonna do now... Can we put glowstone underneath that as well? Because I don't know if this glowstone actually emits any light. It should do. But do you? So maybe if we put glowstone here as well. Yes, I'm going to, to Paris. I'm going to fly from Copenhagen. In Denmark. And uh, going to meet up with Doc there. He's, I think he's taking a train there. So, you know, he's not flying. That's going to be pretty fun. I don't know what we're going to do though. But, but we're gonna figure that out. Like, I know we're going to have an event, right? But after that, I mean... Partying with Doc in Paris. But a vlog, that would be. Or vlog, as I say it. That is nice. O okay, just imagine. Do I get any iron on me? No iron, no bushes. I came unprepared. God damn it, Kiralis. But I'm thinking, like, bushes on top. Trees all over the place. Dude, I'm recording. Dude, shh. Okay. I'm gonna be so jumped by 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 mobs now, but yeah, that kind of rocks my boat. We could even make if we make a stair here. You know what? Which looks better, the slabs or the stair? I don't like that for some reason. Well, it's just me being picky, I guess. But if we could take this out to here. Sorry, you know, you know why I am. I need, to, I need to try out all the different possibilities for this and see how everything looks. Because I was thinking, like, we could make... I say I was thinking. That kind of looks alright, I guess, I guess. Does it? Does it really? No, I don't know. Nah, I think this looked better. Stare, and that's perfect. The only thing I we kind of miss out is the doors, because it would be pretty convenient having doors here. But then again, we can have some trap doors. Not trap doors, I mean those little thing things. <laughs> what are they called? You know the doors. I'm going to show you what I mean. Those doors. What are they called? Fence gates. Right. 
I've been playing this a lot. Don't worry, I'm not a noob. I'm a professional. <laughs> not really, Keralis, not really. There we go. Safe and secure, although it's pretty dark on the inside, so creepies and stuff will spawn. I can't place torches on that. So let's just place them back here, I guess. Just for now, you know what? We can we can figure our stuff out later on. Torch, come to daddy. And what I'm gonna do now, I'm just gonna go buy some bushes in the bush shop, or flowers at least, and we're gonna pimp this. Maybe off camera, because that's kinda boring, you know, pimping <laughs> and stuff like that. But I'm gonna get back to you guys, because we're gonna read a newspaper as well. And as well, I'm gonna show you the final result. Because I might tweak this, because I'm not really sure I like it. What I don't like about this is this border here. But I as figured, like, if I put this out by one more block out here, that's gonna look... not here. Whoops. I tell ya, my pick. It's amazing. I'm just slashing through the course like there was no tomorrow. <laughs> what have I broken? Like, everything. Oh no, oh no. One more here, right? And that's gonna be it. You know what? I'm not touching anything. I'm not touching anything. I'm going I'm going to buy some bushes. <laughs> be right back with you guys. Oh baby! I came prepared. 64 diamonds. So alright, so let's check this out. One gold bar is equals 10, one diamond equals 100. So one stack 64, let's buy maybe six stacks of stuff. That's gonna be 380. Four, I guess, right? Six stacks, you know what? One, two, three, and four. So that is 400 stuffs. So first of all, I like those blue orchids. I love them a lot. <laughs> OCD will kill you because why did you take from the end? I don't know. So two stacks of those. Sunflowers. Oh, babe. I don't have sunflowers even. I, don't, I haven't even found them, I guess. Two stacks of sunflowers just for the future reference, you know, maybe we need them. One stack of that, and then we still need, let me see, I got five stacks. So, one more stack and 16 things. <laughs> I think we might need one more stack of those. <laughs> I'm like the best shopper ever here. What else do we got here? So, 16 of something. You know what, I kind of like those, but I kind of dislike those, so I'm not gonna pick them. What else? Damn, it's so hard, you know what, I'm gonna take those small ones. So let me see here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 10, 11, <laughs> 12, 13, 14, 15, and 16. I can see a creeper, by the way. That's kind of scary, because I don't want to destroy stuff. You go away now, you go away, you go away. And just because of the nice idea, whoever this, you know, who those was, was, I'm going to put one extra diamond. Hack for this shop. I <laughs> love it. All right, let me just get back there, bush it up a bit, and you're going to see the final result. And then we're going to... Oh, yeah, you know what? Once we are here, are you an employee of Cleo Zombie? Or are you cattle? No, not cattle. <laughs> Maybe there's a pissed employee. Let me just kill this guy. Oh, now they are pissed. Look at Carol going. Let me just read about this. It's gonna be a long episode today, I guess. One diamond for your f for four issues direct to your door. Leave your name in the this book. Blah blah. blah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> and host to the Batmobile. <laughs> Keralis. Oh, we should we should make like oh you should we should we should get our our issues back to the Mesa biome because that's so far away just because Zombie Cleo might have stolen my horse. Hermiton House. There we go. Done. All right, so I'm gonna place one diamond for the subscription, right? But I'm still gonna take my issue for today because I need that. You know what? Let's put an extra diamond as well for this number because I don't have any gold bars on me. Don't worry. Don't rage, I'm gonna put the book in here. There we go, all right? I'm sorry, I forgot to do that. Well, hello there. Look at this, we bushed it up. All right, so it doesn't look perfect, all right? But we got so many bushes, it just looks, I don't know, a home away from home, if you know what I mean. So you know what, a pool or a gazebo, I don't know. I, I, go, I like the gazebo. 
let me just let me just end up pull up here somewhere let me see oops if you can see from my bed whoops holy snap <laughs> i am close i should make a tunnel to this little place because now what i'm doing i'm going all around this mountain and heal it is just stupido we need to figure that out by the way what the hell is this building what have i missed what is this I'm sorry, <laughs> this is gonna be like the longest video ever. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Let me see, what is this? Needful things. Extend the path of him to new area. Shishwami. Needful things. Well, something's going on. You know what? I'm not I'm not gonna I'm not gonna you know reveal anything. Let me just get back here and let me see this place from above. Well I'm gonna those bushes. Look at this. That looks just crazy. This is like, it's so well hidden here in the backyard. Like we might place a pool, don't get me wrong. We might do it in the future about here somewhere or even in the mountains somewhere about. But hopefully you guys enjoy. I mean, it is a gazebo. It's my first gazebo and it looks pretty. I could put window penises here on the sides, but then it wouldn't fit the theme with this here, I guess, you know? Oh, you can just sit here and relax. Hide from everybody, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> and you know what? The question I got for you next episode. The path, you know. Previously, I said I'm going to build a path in this mountain going all the way up here. But I got my second thoughts of building a path going like through those little bush things and all the way up. Do let me know what you guys think. Nevertheless, you know what? Oh, yeah. Yeah, but do let me know, but I've, I remembered something, I built something on the front, <laughs> a car, <laughs> got some pointless projects, but bam, King of Derp is here, the Jeep of Jeeps, that is, I mean, now I got two of those, you know what I should build, I should build like a, a car dealership, nobody would buy it though, but just for fans, I mean, that could be something in the future, I don't know, so let me see the newspaper, let me find it, and I'm gonna meet you guys in the gazebo, gazebo, <laughs> king of derp. And also, please do let me know if you know who placed this here. Because it's a present, it's an awesome present, but who made, who, 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 who did that? It's so nice of them. Love it. No, just look how cozy this looks. I absolutely love it. But you know what? No time to waste. Straight into the gazebo. Bring up the newspaper. And I forgot my coffee cup. You know what? It's an imaginary coffee cup, so it doesn't matter. You guys ready for this? 14 pages? You must be kidding me. This is gonna take forever to read me with my derp English. This is gonna be a long episode. Page 1. Hermit and Herald, issue 2. Fungal infestation at Muse Meats. Reports have been received that a fungal infestation occurred at Muse Meats, a division of Spamco, and has contaminated their produce. <laughs> Was it me? <laughs> no, it wasn't. The owner of Spamco made a statement to this reporter that it possesses a health risk to future customers. <laughs> Was it me? It's funny though. The food wars is a term coined by Spamwag to describe his unethical treatment of neighboring businesses. It is suspected that this infestation was a retaliation by other food business owners and Spamwag has decided to point fingers at soup shop owner by Jevin as a suspect. <laughs> Love it! Perhaps as a way to disguise his own poor manufacturing decisions. Advertisement! <laughs> Hermitcraft Construction Company. Wanna build something, but you don't have the skills. Wanna build something, but you don't have the time. Just hire Hermitcraft Construction Company. We build whatever you want. All you need to do is to provide materials. <laughs> Schism and punches. Love it. No guarantees on the completion dates. Terms subject to change as we see fit. It, if insufficient materials are provided, costs might rise or skyrocket. It's your choice. Hey, don't point any fingers. You called us. You have three hours. <laughs> so derp. Wonderful new shopping experience. It was this reporter's pleasure to be one of the first to experience a retail haven that can be found at Hypno's random item shop. Simply on the outside, 
A tribute to the fallen villagers of last week, perhaps. <laughs> no way, Jose. Hypno has created a store that, whilst not specialized, seems to capture every facet of what a hermit truly needs, all at great prices. The business district is booming, and this store is set to make its mark. <laughs> Love it. Murder at quarter pipe point. <laughs> what the hell? A massive explosion rocketed the city of New Hermiton, and one dead body was pulled from the wreckage. Panjas later swore vengeance on schism, possibly involving <laughs> ninja turtles. The law lawless nature of this town was noted by Shashwami, who swore to consider doing something about it. Bodyguard prices are rocketing in response. <laughs> so derp. Advertisement! <laughs> Sleeps packed ice shoppy. Business is booming at Sleeps packed ice shoppy. But that doesn't mean our prices will change. Three sacks of packed ice for only one diamond? You must be crazy, Slip. And we are crazy at Sleeps packed ice shoppy. <laughs> this is so awesome. Burfs. Hermiton would like to welcome a bouncing baby Maryland to the server. Maryland, welcome to the server. Diffs. <laughs> pungeons, 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 pungeons. Schism, pungeons, schism, schism, pungeons. Schism, DMAC, Kiralis, Kiralis. Yeah, that happened. I kind of killed. I kind of killed pungeons. I killed schism. I killed DMAC. I love it. It goes without saying. These people will be sorely missed. And that is the end of this week's newspaper <laughs> that's so awesome i love it so guys you know what i'm not gonna keep you longer and i'm really sorry about the super long episode but you know what things had to be made and the gazebo is in place and you can't really see it through here because of the bushes but it's here trust me it's here like somewhere about here <laughs> there we go gazebo love it absolutely amazing in my opinion and i will see you oh no a random block like that can only mean endermans or summer abouts nah once again thank you for watching thank you sleepy and thank you to the mysterious person who left this here i'm gonna hug it anyways don't forget to comment, like, favorite if you did enjoy. And I will see you in the next Hermicraft, as wife would have said it. Bam, bada, bim, bada, boom, boom, boom. <laughs> Take care, guys. And bye-bye.